Hey, what's up, guys? John Cochran here. Went to. What was I again? Today is System Saturday. Okay. Yes. That's sad. I did everything myself in here. That is not how you do the business. And that right there is a house that I have already flipped as well. And I already know that I can flip this house to a buyer on my buyer's list because I got a strong buyer's list in this area. Hey, what's up guys? John Cochran here and today is System Saturday, the day that I bring you a system that I use in my business that you can rip off, duplicate using your own local market. Now in today's System Saturday session, what we're gonna talk about is the three ways to quadruple your motivated seller calls, okay? Now, we have all seen them. We have all seen the signs, we have all seen the branding in no numerous different colors, the we buy houses and then the phone number. We buy houses, cash fast, and the phone number. Guys, we used to market this way and I can promise you that with the way that I'm gonna show you how to market today, right now on today's, uh, System Saturday, you will be able to triple, quadruple the calls that you're bringing in now, okay? Now, there's a problem with the We Buy Houses and this is it. Now, they simply don't work and the reason they don't work is, is really because of the branding and the reputation that they're having. Now, if you market into the We Buy Houses, if you market in that name and your bandit signs and your direct mail and all these different avenues that you can uh, market for motivated sellers, will you get calls? Yes. You will get calls, but the truth of it is is that you are missing out on a lot of the calls because you're marketing uh, wrong. That's the simple fact of it. So you will get calls, so I don't want you to think that you're not ever gonna get a call on that because you will get calls, but guys, they have a bad reputation. They have a bad reputation. So back in the day when I was first starting, you know, mo looking for motivated sellers, what I would do was I would call all the We Buy Houses, you know, signs and everything that I saw in, in our own local area. The problem that I found as a seller was none of them called me back. And that's exactly what other sellers are thinking as well. They're calling them and guess what? When they're motivated, they need to sell and they call you and then those people don't call you back. They start getting a bad reputation and that's what happened over the years is that everybody is marketing this We Buy Houses name and the I Buy Houses and all this stuff and the problem is, is that you know the people that are marketing this, they're very uneducated and they don't know how to run a business. So they're getting a bad reputation. So we, what we had to do is we had to completely go away from that name and then we saw our, our motivated seller leads quadruple, okay? So they got a bad reputation. Uh, people associate the big brands, okay? Another reason why we don't do this is people associate the big brands with stealing properties, low offers, and nickel dicking is whatever you want to call it. So think of it like this. So you got this We Buy Houses bandit sign out there or you got We Buy Houses signs out there. The sellers and the seller's eyes, guys, what they are thinking is that this, this is a big brand. This is somebody that is associated with something bigger. All they're gonna do is they just want to literally steal my property. They're gonna give me low offers and they're gonna nickel dick me. They're gonna get the cheapest as they possibly can. And that's not what sellers want. Guys, that's not what sellers want. Sellers want to get the most out of their property as they possibly can, so you have to market to them and give them exactly what they want. So that is the big problem with marketing the We Buy Houses or any of those big brands, We Buy Houses, I Buy Houses, or even your own company name, because that's that you gotta get away from marketing as a big brand, okay? Now we market very, very differently, very, very differently. So what we do in all of our different avenues, this is not just being at signs, this is not just direct mail, throughout all the marketing that we do, we always market for motivated sellers and we're always that local mom and pop shop. You know, just the, the local company that we will buy your property and you know, we probably don't do this very, very often but we're just pretty liquid in cash and you know what, we're not looking to you know, go out and steal property. So that's how we're marketing and that's how it sounds is we're a local mom and pop shop. Another one is we're marketing we're honest, we're absolutely honest. So we are portraying that in all of our marketing because we are very honest and open with them. So whenever they call us, we're honest with them. Whenever we go to the meeting, we're honest with them, which when we make our offer, we're honest with them and which is gonna get us more properties. We also market different because guys, we're just marketing that some, we're just somebody looking to build our portfolio. Okay, we're just somebody out there, a local mom and pop shop who's honest, just looking to build our portfolio. We're not really, telling the public that we're doing this as a huge massive business unless they ask us, okay? So we're also marketing for somebody who will pay a very, very fair price. So every one of these things, 
is exactly what a motivated seller wants you to tell them in all of your marketing. And when you do exactly what they want you to do, they're simply gonna pick up the phone and they're gonna call you. They don't want you to lowball their house. They don't want you to steal their property. This is what they want, so you gotta give it to them. So that's how we market. So what we do, and all the different avenues that we're marketing at is guys, we will change it up from the we buy houses, the I buy houses, or even our own company name, somebody that's going to go out and lowball them because we're doing this for a profit. And now we will just change the marketing up a little bit. We will make it more local mom and pop shop feel. So instead of we buy houses, we're changing it to Johnny buys houses. We'll do it with Johnny buys houses. We'll do something like Rick buys homes or even sell your house in five days. That gives you every single thing that I just talked about of what a seller is wanting. And I can promise you that whenever you change up the way that you're marketing for motivated sellers and you change it to your first name buys houses, Rick buys homes, your first name buys homes, or even sell your house in five days, I guarantee you that you're going to triple and quadruple every single one of your seller calls that you're getting right now. So guys, I hope you enjoy the video. Go implement this stuff immediately and I'll see you on the next System Saturday.